Good morning guys and welcome back to Six Kids and a Husband, a day in our life. And if you've seen from um, the clip before, the weather is not so nice and the weather pretty much matches the mood of the house because we are headed back to the children's hospital. If you guys know, um, if you are subscribed to our channel, do you know Lorenzo had surgery on his neck last month for a cyst that he had. Um, if you don't know, you can click here to see that vlog. And anyway, um, the cyst is back. And we are headed back to the children's hospital to um, hopefully find out exactly what it is because it doesn't make sense to me for a cyst to be coming back twice. So we're going to go there and hopefully get some answers and find out what is really happening. So, yeah, let's head there. You're going to show me your neck. Turn to the side. As you guys can see, stand just like that. You guys can see this is the big, I guess it's a cyst, but it's really big. And we're going to go get, going to go get that checked out. And Olivia is coming. And she is not really nice right now. Not sure why. Are you tired? I mean, you can sleep in the car. Okay, don't talk to me. Okay, just stare at me. Okay, don't stare at me. Okay, stare at me. So guys, we made it to the hospital. Hopefully they will um, get to see Lorenzo and not say that we need an appointment because at, cause at this station they say you need an appointment. So hopefully they can see Lorenzo and figure out what's wrong with him. What do you think they're gonna do? I have no idea. Either we have a good doctor and they look at him and do something, or we have an asshole when they say we should go home. Why would we go home? You see, I'm not going home. Why would I go home? It's not an emergency. So right now we're just waiting and waiting. Um, one doctor said that this is not a cyst, that there is no liquid, mm -hmm. and then he called another doctor to check it, mm -hmm. and the other doctor said that it's a hemorrhage, and then he went to the computer and read the biopsy results, biopsy results and he got really quiet and now he kind of ran out and got the, the main doctor, the boss? The head doctor. Yeah. Yep. They told us they want to wait a week and see if it's getting bigger or not. Mm -hmm. We know that game already. So we wait a week and then we come back. So guys, it is a week later and we are headed back to the, the hospital to um, see what the doctors say about Lorenzo's um, thing in his neck and we'll see what they say. So we're about to head out there now. Neck? Huh? What neck is his throat? This is a neck. I, oh my God. This is a neck, throat, same thing. Yeah, the neck is here. That's the throat. She said the neck is in the back. This nigga. All right. Go to the hospital. So, bye.
You can't take your stroller, bro. I gotta push it. Olivia, I gotta push it. She ready. Olivia, it's not time to play. Come on. No, we're not taking that. Olivia, we're not taking that. Come on. You can play with that later. She don't want to listen. Women. Alright guys, we're in the car and we're headed out. Andrea's here, just in case y'all were, were wondering. You know, people always ask where you at when I don't show you for like two minutes. Because it's my... Don't you dare say that. It is, it is not your channel. It is not. It is no, our channel. It was once, once upon a time. When it sucked. Stop Mama. saying that, okay? Then stop making it suck. Like, you're so cocky. I'm not cocky. Seriously. I just, no, I'm not cocky. You think so? You, yes? No, I'm not. You think you're so much better than everybody I don't think else. I'm so much better than everybody else. I just said you can't lie and say that your first three videos were not good at all. They weren't. They were not. And then I came to and showed they are because that was a, a nice... Are you saying memory? memory? And that's, that's what people who have shit that sucks say. It was a nice memory, but I didn't shit. do that for people, and exactly. I'm still not doing it for people, sweetheart. I'm just saying that it's nice now. Where the hell are you going? To Nuremberg. So guys, we made it here, and the good thing about it is that we got a parking spot right in front of the hospital, but I have to go get a parking um, ticket now so that we can legally park here, and then we're going to go see what the doctor says about Lorenzo. By the doctor getting that ultrasound on his neck and Olivia if you see her behind me was starting to trip out so I went out in the hallway with her so that they can finish doing the um checking Lorenzo's neck Olivia what do we do now you can't go that way we gotta go back the other way come on so guys we have to wait to see the anesthesiologist because what did the doctor say we have to go there and fill all the paper out that because, we know about the risks. And yeah, because the doctor said that um, next Thursday they are going to, the doctor said next week they are going to go take out the thing in his throat. So, yeah, we have to talk to the anesthe anesthesiologist to make an appointment and to make sure that we know all the risks of all the um, medicine that they're going to give him for that. So, yeah, we'll see you guys next week when we have to take do Lorenzo's surgery. Good morning guys, it is a week later and today is the day that Lorenzo goes to get his second operation on his throat. Um, as you could probably guess, we are all a little bit on edge because from the last time, I can honestly say that shit scared the shit out of me. And um, Lorenzo says today is going to be a great day, which I'm, not, which I'm not sure if that's a good thing that he thinks that or if that's a bad thing that he thinks that because if it's a good day and then they cut his throat open, I'm sure he's not going to be too happy about that. But yeah, anyway, um, we're going to head to the hospital now because we have to be there at 7 o'clock in the morning, which is not that bad, but we live an hour and a half away from the hospital and Andrea just cut it on to be an asshole. But yeah, I'll talk to you guys in the car. So yeah, we're headed there now. Andrea is driving. Say hello, Andrea. Hello. Uh, Lorenzo's in the back seat. Say hi, Lorenzo. Hi, YouTube. <laughs> so yeah, we're headed there now at 7 o'clock in the morning, which isn't that bad, but it is bad because we live uh, almost an hour and a half away from the hospital and we have older kids who need to get sent off to school. So it's kind of rushing everything and plus the whole hospital thing is kind of making the mood really bad. bad. So let's just say today is not a good morning, but we're going to get through it and everything's going to be okay. So we'll talk to you guys again when we're at the hospital. Two hours later. So guys, we made it to the hospital late, but we're here and we're in the doctor's office waiting to see what the doctor's going to say. Um, our friend is a nurse here and she said that Lorenzo is first on the 
um, operation list. So hopefully that means that he's going to be going there soon and we can get all this behind us and move on, right? Yeah. Because he's sensing again and woke him up. Why? What? Because he didn't want to go to go pick him. So the doctor just looked at him and said that it looks like it's infected and I'm not a nurse so I don't know what this means but uh, instead of closing up the scar the they um they want to leave it open to flush out all the stuff and now the head doctor has to come look at it so yeah Say hi, YouTube. So at least he's still in good spirits. So at least that makes one of us. Twenty minutes later. So the head doctor just came in and pretty much told us that they have to do two operations now. One to get all the bacteria out of there, and then once all the bacteria is done and it's clean, then they can go in there and try to take out the whatever it is. So apple, apple is—I don't think it's an apple in there. So we have two. Spend right. who knows one week, two weeks in the hospital, which we are looking forward to. And Andrea's kind of pissed off because she says if they would have did it the first time correctly, then we wouldn't even be here for that now. So yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. Lorenzo. I want it. You want what? I want to half of your Yeah, we gotta wait. But I mean, we are gonna be spending a lot of time together. So hey. Are you ready to have fun with me? Yeah. Yeah, right? Yeah. What we gonna do? Play with our cars. Play with our cars. Watch yeah. some TV. You play with the remote control car. Play with the remote control car, yeah, right? Yeah. So guys, now we're back up at the place where I will call home for the next week or so. Hopefully, less than that. Which is where we were at last time. If you guys don't remember that, then click here to see when the last time Lorenzo was in the hospital. Because we were in the exact same sad ass yellow painted room but now we have to wait to see when lorenzo gets his operation because we were late so they moved somebody else up and we we're just sitting here waiting to see when he goes to get his operation and what's going to happen right say something I can say nothing right now. my brakes are broke and i don't have wheels on my back yes abba yeah, I have to wheel down in bed. You fixed it? Mm-hmm. I didn't see Mm-hmm. So we just got Lorenzo's room. Looks like we have the room to ourselves for now. Mm -hmm. But I'm sure some... come back upstairs. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and, and then they took over our bed. <laughs> and they told Lorenzo to get comfortable, which tells me he won't be getting surgery for a while. Two hours later. guys they came and got us and Lorenzo is about to get his surgery now and we will talk to you after he gets the surgery and let you know how it went so they just put Lorenzo to sleep and took him to go get his first surgery which is to put a cut here to let all the bacteria come out they have to flush it out for the next few days and once it's not infected anymore then they can do the real surgery which is to actually take the cyst out so we have to wait for the surgery and then let us know when it's done so guys it's been about two hours and we still have not heard anything about how Lorenzo was doing and to top the um, feeling of waiting not knowing how your kid is doing Andrea says she's having contractions not then what other kind of contractions are you having? I don't know. Yeah, so she wanted to go walk around some, and that's what we're doing now, just walking around, wasting the time away until we find out what's happening with Lorenzo, which Andrea says she has a really bad feeling. Not just they, they told us 20 minutes. They told us it would take 20 minutes. Yeah. Yeah, and I just think they're trying to get everything done at once. That can take so long. Yeah, well, we don't know. 20 minutes later. Mama is <laughs> okay, what did the doctor say? Um, he said that they opened his throat and it was not a cyst, 
Mm -hmm. You don't know what it was. He said he don't know. But he think this time he got it all out. Okay. And what about the biopsy? You didn't say nothing. I know, but don't say who said it, but you know something about, about, about the biopsy. Yeah, we know. You mentioned it before, right? We mm -hmm. know someone who works down oh, yeah. there. Yeah. And she said that um, they took a piece and sent it to the biopsy. So... So for sure we're going to wait until we find out what that is. It's this cloud of cancer still. You look pregnant as shit. Circling around us. Yeah. Six and a half hours later. Hi YouTube, I'm okay. So guys, it's a few hours later. Andrea's already at home with the girls. And I'm here with Lorenzo. As you guys can see, and as he said, oh, I'm sweating because it is hot as shit. But um, as you can see, Lorenzo is up and awake. And he's... At first, when he woke up, he wasn't really sure where he was, and he wasn't really Lorenzo. But now he is back to Lorenzo. He ate. He's talking. He's asking for his cars. And, yeah, he's doing good for today. It's about 6 o'clock at night, so we're going to play a little bit with his cars, and then he's going to go to bed. So I just want to um, end the vlog off here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, click that bell to be notified when we upload new videos, because, hey, we upload every other day. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And until next video. Peace out. Thank you.